controlling that little voice. I was recently in Las Vegas, and one of my clients, after I gave a presentation, said, hey, that little voice, does everybody have that little voice? Because I talk about that little voice. You know the little voice I'm talking about? It's that, only, that little voice only you can hear. It never lies to you, and you can never lie to it. Well, this lady said, I've got that little voice, and it's got a southern accent. I said, yes, everybody's got that little voice. She said, well, she said, well how do you control it? Well, the first thing is, as I said, you can never lie to it, and it will never lie to you. So you have to have prepared, and once you've prepared properly for that task, you can keep that little voice positive. That's very important to stay positive. Now, what do I really mean by that? Well, I'll give you an example. I had properly prepared as a pilot, so when I had an emergency, that little voice was positive with me. I really thought that I was going to make it the night both engines came off. I always knew I was going to make it, and so did that little voice. Golf. I know from being an athlete that you really have to practice. I don't practice enough in golf. So it really is hard for me because I know I haven't practiced. Sometimes that little voice is negative. But if you properly prepare, you can control that little voice, and it will be positive for you. And then you'll perform under pressure the way you want to. You'll excel under pressure.